What's going on? Tanner here with another video. I hope you're having an amazing and productive day so far. In this video right now, I'm going to show you how to build a landing page for a how-to PDF on Shopify. And this is something that I made a video about a couple of weeks ago, and it's gotten a massive amount of views for my typical videos on my channel, and you guys have absolutely loved it. So this is the follow-up because in that video, I said if this gets over 500 likes, I will make this video, which I'm filming right now. So in this video, I'm going to show you not how to make the PDF because that's in the previous video, but now I'm going to show you how to actually make the pages to actually sell that PDF with your marketing. So without further ado, let's hop onto my computer and get into the details. Now here is the opportunity, and it's that the ability to turn a simple idea into a clickable listicle in a high converting product page has never been easier, especially with artificial intelligence doing most of the heavy lifting. And here's the reality. Most people have never even heard of a listicle, maybe even you. Meanwhile, smart sellers like myself and others are using artificial intelligence to build listicles that grab attention, lead readers to a product page, and convert that traffic into daily sales all while staying behind the scenes. So in this guide right now, I'm going to show you the exact AI-driven process that I use to create listicles that sell and how to turn them into product pages that convert. And I'll be showing you this step by step. So make sure you like this video if you get value from it. And this is what you'll actually learn, which is one, how to actually use artificial intelligence to find listicle topics with proven click-through potential, then how to actually structure a listicle so it naturally leads to a sale, and then the AI tools that I actually use to design fast, clean, and high converting product pages, and how to do this as a beginner with a $0 product creation cost. Now here's the facts. The global digital product market is experiencing rapid growth with various segments showing significant expansion. And market research reports estimate the digital goods market to be valued at over $124 billion this year and are projected to reach over $416 billion by 2030. And this is something that you can Google and look up the actual statistics and facts for yourself because I want you to actually understand and believe in this. And the second fact is that listicles are highly effective content formats. They are easily scannable, they reduce the bounce rate, and significantly increase engagement. Because what typically happens when you're selling a how-to PDF, if you're marketing and you send people directly to a product page just for that product, automatically most people are going to stray away because they simply don't want to either acknowledge that they have a problem or that they want to have it solved and that they don't want to be sold to just yet. Since this is a digital product that you're going to be selling and it doesn't have that instant perceived value like a watch tells the time, you have to build that value and actually educate the potential customer on why they need this product and how it's going to benefit them. Because they don't actually care whether it's a PDF or a video course or any other type of digital product. They just want to actually know and believe that this is going to help them and provide them more value than what the actual price tag is for the digital product. So let's go ahead and get into the actual listicle creation so that way you can see how this actually works and how it will look for your product page. And this is the full AI method to create a selling listicle plus product page because we are actually going to create two pages. Instead of just having a product page, we're going to have our listicle first. And what you want to do is think of this initially as kind of an article. We're not going to be writing blog posts or anything like that, but what we're going to be looking for are ideas and topics that actually educate our potential customers in our niche. So the way to find a clickable topic and one that could work good for your product is to open ChatGPT and use a prompt like this. Give me 10 viral listicle ideas in the niche space that people would click on. For example, I use the faceless YouTube channel niche and received these 10 topic ideas, such as 10 faceless YouTubers who went viral overnight, seven high CPM niches, perfect for faceless channels, the eight easiest videos to make for faceless YouTube channels, seven faceless channels that get millions of views using only stock footage. These are all topics that are meant to generate curiosity and interest that will then educate the potential customer and then turn them into a paying customer. That way they're actually sold on the idea before they ever even get to the product page. Some other examples in that niche would be things like seven ways to start a faceless YouTube channel this week, 10 tools every beginner needs for video creation, and five mistakes new creators make that kill their growth. And the topic you choose for your listicle is purely dependent on the niche and audience that you're helping. So if my PDF is helping people open their channel and make their first video, I know that I'm going to be helping complete beginners versus helping people who already have a channel. That's a completely different segment 
which means I would use a different listicle topic for each of those. So in this case, for complete beginners, I could say here are seven reasons why faceless channels are exploding in 2025, which leads to step number two, which is to actually outline the listicle in every step. So the easiest way to do this is to use ChatGPT to structure each point with a short curiosity-driven header, two to four sentences of value-driven content, and a subtle segue towards the product offer. And what I've gone ahead here and done is open my Shopify store, installed the Gym Pages app, and have gone here to create a new page. And here on creating a new page, there are multiple different templates you can choose from. You could of course start from complete scratch, but what I've done is I went over here to advertorial page, and then what I've done is scroll down, and I like this one. I felt like it best matched the listicle format. It's called listicle, so I selected that. And by default, this is what it looks like. It definitely looks more like an actual blog post, and it has an example here about this new baking appliance, and it outlines it very, very simple. But what I've done with the help of artificial intelligence and Jim Page's easy drag and drop tool, I've gone ahead and just redesigned this to better fit my audience and my niche. So what I chose as my actual topic was seven reasons why faceless YouTube channels are exploding in 2025 and how to start yours this week. And instead of having an author, I removed that part and just went ahead and did a summary and got straight to the point here of the actual lists. Point number one being low barrier to entry. No expensive cameras, no fancy studios, just your laptop and an idea. This makes it accessible for anyone, even if you've never made a video before. Plus, the starter kit is 50% off. Number two, it's perfect for privacy. Whether you're shy on camera or want to keep your identity hidden, faceless channels let you build an audience without sacrificing your personal life. I'll show you exactly how to do this. Number three, AI tools do the heavy lifting. From generating scripts to editing and creating visuals, AI tools now handle the hardest parts of content creation, and you'll get access to all of my top AI tools. Number four, there's a huge range of profitable niches, animation, finance, health, productivity, storytelling, faceless formats work in dozens of niches, many with millions of daily searches. You can even have my winning niche list as a bonus. And then comes the introduction of my offer, kind of in the middle of this list. And then that leads to number five, which is consistent content equals consistent growth. With the right systems, you can post regularly without burnout. The key to getting into YouTube's algorithm and staying there. My smart calendar will help you stay on track. Number six, multiple monetization options. Ads are just the beginning. Think sponsorships, affiliate links, and your own digital products, like the one you're reading about right now. And number seven, you can start this week. It's not a six month learning curve. With the right guide, you can set up your channel and post your first video in just days. I have the proven process for you. And again, having the offer here. Now, this part is not meant to completely sell them. Like this is not an add to cart or checkout button. This button then goes to the product page so that they can actually make a decision and be able to actually buy the product versus just reading this information. This is essentially priming your potential customer to buy the product because like I said, with a digital product, we have to build the perceived value. And that brings me here back to step number three, which I've kind of shown, which is to link the offer naturally. So at the end of your listicle and in this template, I've also had one kind of in the middle that basically has a transition to the product page. So even on mobile, if I go here, you can see kind of how it looks. Scroll down, we have our listicle, and then the people on this page are being promoted here to the actual product page so they can see what it's all about and make a decision, all while being educated. If you've ever heard of an advertorial, it's essentially a longer form version of a listicle, but these days with people and short attention spans, a listicle is just a much better option. And now step number four is to actually build the product page with artificial intelligence. So what I just showed you is the listicle, but we need to have something else that people go to when they click on a button on the listicle. And what we're going to do is use gym pages so that way everything is in sync and makes sense. We also want to have the highest chance of converting these actual visitors into sales and this is how we're going to do it. This is a product page template that I created for this example for the faceless YouTube starter kit. What I have here is three bullet points that outline the benefits and what the potential customer is getting with this product, the price, the call to action, and then getting into some more information regarding the actual offer and how it helps them so that they can get started right now. And adding what's included is important for your product page for a digital product. These two have been left as placeholder images, but what I'll say here is you want to include your main offer and then bonuses 
that help shorten the process for someone getting results with your offer. So if I'm selling this as a low ticket PDF for $27, I'm not promising the world. I'm not promising getting a million subscribers or making a ton of money or anything like that. Instead, at this price point, we want to make a reasonable promise in our PDF to deliver on that promise, which in this case would be to help you create your faceless channel and then post your very first video all within one week. So the entire product page is meant to convey that that's the value proposition. Here's how it works. And here's what's included, such as the starter kit, plus these bonuses that will help you get that result that I just mentioned at an even quicker speed. And then I would add reviews here, an unconditional guarantee, and frequently asked questions. So this is what the listicle looks like on desktop. It has the list here. This is where I'd be sending my traffic. And here's the actual product page with everything put together. And if you want my exact templates plus more to get results like my students are doing right here, 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 and here, just message me the word YouTube on Instagram and I'll give you the details on how I've been able to help countless people build their own digital dropshipping income and how this could work for you and how we could even work together. If you're watching this video in the month that it's posted, then you have a super special opportunity before we have our massive price raise as we get into quarter four. So again, just message me the word YouTube on Instagram. I'll put my app right here. It's at Tanner with two R's and we'll chat soon. Now, step number five is to add visual proof. So things like product mockups, screenshots, or testimonial style images, these can all be done by ChatGPT in just minutes. All of the images here on this listicle, as well as the product page, were actually made with ChatGPT. I didn't do anything fancy at all. All I did was I went to ChatGPT after generating the points for my listicle and said, describe the prompt I'll use for image generation for each of these seven lists. And what it's done is given me the prompts right here. So all I did was copy this prompt, I pasted it in here, I chose image, and I said square dimensions, and I submitted it for each one of the seven. For the product image, I said a mock-up product image for the faceless YouTube starter kit PDF in square format with a transparent background. And step number six is to actually publish and promote your listicle. So this is where you'll actually be sending your traffic when you're marketing. So if you're running ads, you'll be sending people directly to your listicle. Now don't stop watching just here because there are still some important things that I need to cover which is the context template for more advanced AI results. You probably see all types of artificial intelligence tools being talked about every single day. Nobody can truly keep up. So the best thing that you can do is figure out how to use one singular platform as effectively as possible. And for most use cases, in terms of digital dropshipping, it's going to be ChatGPT. So when prompting for your listicle ideas and actually creating the list, what you can do is add a lot more details when it comes to your niche. So if you're someone who already has an audience and you're building a product for that audience, you can absolutely outline your niche, the actual experience of your audience, and explain exactly who you are, what you do, and who your audience is. And now you'll start to get more listicle ideas that are exactly what your ideal audience wants to hear. And final tips, you want to keep your listicle short, punchy, and curiosity driven. You want to get people interested in your solution so that they click on the product page and then convert. And you always want to lead with value before mentioning the product, use matching visuals on the listicle and the product page for brand consistency, and don't overthink it. AI handles the structure, you just guide the direction. And to start turning clicks into customers, you just need to know that this method works if you put it into action. AI can't magically and it won't magically just make people buy, but it eliminates 80% of the ant work so you can just focus on the creative side and having a good product so you can market and then make sales and profit. Now, if this video gets over 500 likes, I'll make the next video showing you how to make and launch ads for a how-to PDF. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a big like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.